I am here at the British Par 3 Championships and I'm filming uh, Chris Guy. Chris is a playing professional uh, and teaches out of Turkey actually uh, at the moment, um, native of uh, the UK but spent a lot of his time playing on the Sunshine Tour in South Africa. Um, working here at the British Par 3 Championships, we've been getting a whole bunch of students in here. Uh, Chris, I'm going to ask you a question. You, you work in the power slider there. Yeah. Um, Obviously, I know that uh, uh, the pieces of equipment, and one that I'm very familiar with, obviously, um, use a roller. Um, what do you see the benefits of being at the slider? Yeah, the slider doesn't roll, obviously. It's, just, it's, it's giving us a less, uh, it's a little bit heavy, a little bit lighter, so we're not, uh, we're not struggling with uh, students with a pre-release on the way down. We're able to, uh, certainly for a better player as well, being able to teach, uh, to teach them, help them understand what the lag feeling is, retaining the angle on the way down. The rollers tend to unwind themselves, if you like. It gives us gives us a problem when we're teaching students to retain the angle. Retaining the angle helps us keep the power base of the golf swing on the way down and through on pre-impact, if you like. And um, one of the other benefits is, is when I when I release the power slider, I don't have a feeling that my right forearm's rotating out of the way. I'm trying to keep my body keep my body and my arms working together with the power slider, and I'm able to release it. What feels more of a natural release, right? More than a, as, a, as opposed to a forced release. Yeah, and I noticed there that we've got a there's, there's, there's a film of rubber around the mm. around the plane swing hoop there. That's right. Um, and that's that's building up. Uh, it's offering a little bit of um, a bit of resistance. Right. From the from, from the from the power slider. Obviously, the power slider is made out of a good quality rubber. Mm. It's just leaving a little bit of a trace, similar to a car going around a racetrack. It's just adding a little bit of. Uh, resistance for the roller as it's going around which is helping us produce a little bit more lag on the way down so it feels a little heavier than it actually is it's right. a, a good way of feeling it right okay brilliant that's great chris thank